lovely weather. A warm welcome to Selhurst Park here in London. My name is Derek Ray, and joining me for commentary is Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Crystal Palace taking on Liverpool. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Number 10, Ederechi Eze. Number 15, Jeffrey Schlock. Number 9, Jordan Ayu. Number 22, Edson Edward. And here's the Palace 11. Jeffrey Schlock starts alongside Ederechi Eze in central midfield. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. And this is how Liverpool start the game. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Andrew Robertson starts with Trent Alexander-Arnold in the fullback positions. Thiago starts alongside Fabinho in the centre of midfield. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. Thank you, Sanders Park. Enjoy the game. A match that should be chock full of talking points. Liverpool get it going. Guehi. Jeffrey Schrupp. Ezzy. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. A fine reading of the situation. Odson Edouard. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Making progress. Couldn't quite hang on. Danger averted for now. Fabinho. Thiago. Harvey Elliott. Sloppy with the ball, Nathaniel Klein. Offside, close one. Just cutting off the supply. And close, but offside nonetheless. <laughs> Tiago. And a chance to whip it in here. Textbook defending inside the box. Odson Edouard. Real chance. Oh, denied by the keeper. Well, what more can you say? That's goalkeeping at its very best. 
An opportunity to forge ahead from this corner situation. Who can they pick out? On the corner, too close to the goalkeeper that time. Well, there you have it. Liverpool have controlled most of the possession. But with the talent they have on show here, the lack of quality in the attacking third has been a real disappointment. They need to play with more urgency to win this one. Indeed, and looking to make good use of their possession this time. Let's just clarify the injury situation. Our man on the side of the pitch is Jeff Shreves. Nasty landing on the shoulder for him there, and he's in real discomfort. He's a tough boy, I think he'll stay on. Cheers, Jeff. Delightful pass. Zaha. The cross is on. Can they forge ahead? And a decent save. Full credit. Well, just listen to these fans. They're urging their team to score here and take the lead. And he's fired over the corner. And that is going to be all for the first 45 here at Selhurst Park. Well, not really too many opportunities for Mo Salah to show us class in this game, Stuart. Well, it's not been a great performance from him today, but can he just find that spark? We know he's a good player, but not on today's performance. He just hasn't looked a threat. So back underway here into the second half. See some progress with the ball at his feet. Can he find the net? Oh, keeper dealt with it. Substitution time it is here. And deciding to go short with this one. Perfect example of how to put in a tackle. And a corner will be next. Can someone get on the end of this? Well, it wasn't a taxing save. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Ezzy. And Zaha has it. Sheikh Dukure. Ayou. Very quick thinking there. Harvey Elliott. Elliott. Fabinho. Could be threatening. Are you? What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Can John Scott, that's John Scott, please make your way to the ticket office. You have your wife's ticket. Thank you. Henderson. Salah, free kick awarded to Liverpool, they decided that now is the time to go to the bench. It has to be, and there it is, the 
deadlock has been broken. We wondered if a goal would arrive. Well, now it has. And will there be a response now? Well, as the replay shows, this is all about his ability to find space in the box, which then makes the finish look so much easier. That's good play from him. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. And support available. And a good-looking ball. But in fact, he's taken up an offside position. Oh, that's frustrating. He just took too long to see the pass. Just ten minutes remaining here. Well, this game will shortly be history and the home side appear to be on the wrong end of the scoreline. Stuart, give us your take. Well, they've certainly lacked a goal threat up to this point. There's been little invention, no real combination play around the box and the crosses have been erratic. But there is still time to find that moment of inspiration. Fabinho. Can he do it from miles out? Able to get a body in the way. He has teammates around him. And the referee is going to add on four added minutes. And that was a very fine read. Well, the fans are certainly playing their part here. Just listen to this noise. And the referee blows for full time. It has gone awry for Crystal Palace and their supporters. No points for them. Well, Derek, not quite good enough today. Yes, they only lost by one goal, but I never felt they were in control of the game. A frustrating day all round for the coach to think about for the next time. His performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Stuart. Well, that performance sums him up, really. You're never disappointed with what he gives you. Such a good player.